Welcome to another episode of Jive's Top 5. In this episode, we are going to break down and pick the top 5 SMGs in the Call of Duty franchise. This is probably the toughest task. So if you have another top 5, put it in the comments. Or make your own video and link me to it. This is going to be one of the toughest top fives that I will ever do. Even putting them in order was mind bending. But without further ado, let me get into my picks. Number five is coming from Black Ops 2, the MSMC. The MSMC is one of the most versatile SMGs in Call of Duty history not only in black ops 2 the msmc has false recoil that's a term that i made up because it looks like it's recoiling but it really just goes back into place and it's also a long range weapon plus you don't lose many gunfights up close if you're new to call of duty and you're just picking up black ops 2 for some reason pick the msmc run around and start owning some noobs. Number four comes from Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3, the MP7. The MP7 is an SMG that could have been in the assault rifle category. It has that much range and it only loses close quarter battles to one SMG that's on this list that's in the same game. Overall, it's one of the best SMGs. It has a great fire rate and the extended mags attachment helps you spray and pray like all the Call of Duty pros. Overall, it's definitely in my top five SMGs in Call of Duty history. It's a solid weapon. Number three is coming from Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3, the PP90M1. Everybody calls it the PP901 or the Super Soaker. This SMG, if you lose an up close gunfight, you always watch the kill cam. Something had to be wrong. This gun has one of the fastest fire rates of any SMG in Call of Duty history. Maybe the Scorpion from Black Ops 2 had a faster fire rate, but this gun had so much ammo in the magazine or the Super Soaker tank that picking this weapon on a close quarters map was a no brainer. This was like the FAMAS of SMGs. Need I say more? Overall, a spectacular weapon. Number two comes from Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2, the UMP45. This was the weapon that everybody used when they were trying to get a nuke. Combining this with Modern Warfare 2's great hit detection, no recoil, Plus the 45 caliber ammo makes it into a melt machine. I'm sorry to tell you this, but if you never got a nuke or a very high gameplay with this weapon, you weren't that good. Put it like this. If you're the only one in the lobby using this weapon and you're the worst player in the lobby, you'll come out in the top four players in the whole lobby. Overall, it's a very good weapon. And my number one SMG in the Call of Duty franchise comes from Call of Duty World at War, the MP40. I'd like to thank the Legend of Thunder for using his gameplay. I ripped it off of his channel. I'm sure he won't mind. His link will be in the description if you don't know who he is. The MP40 was such a dominant weapon in World at War. It was like it wasn't even supposed to be in the game. 
It was light years ahead of all of the other weapons in the game. Plus it hits hard. Using this gun wasn't even fair. You could put a drum magazine on this weapon, let alone when enemies see the bullets, they die. They don't even have to get hit. They see the bullets and they die. That was a joke. If this weapon isn't number one on your list, please put your list in the comment section so everyone can laugh. If you like these types of videos, please thumbs the video up and share it on your social network. And in the comments, tell me what top five I should do next. I'm out. Jive Turkey.